what is going on y'all we are down at edisto beach wrapping up about to go home it is monday and today's video is gonna be a little bit different we've got a couple crabs here in the cooler and i have heard that if you essentially freeze a crab and these crabs have been on ice for probably 12 hours they ain't moving that you i would think they've looked just by looking at them i think they're dead but i've heard if you freeze them and then bring them off the ice and get them out in the uh, you don't even have to get them out in the sun just get them where they can warm up they'll come back to life so we're about to give that a we're about to give it a shot and see if it'll happen um, we're gonna put the gopro on them do a little time lapse and see one will they come back to life and two how long is it gonna take comment below if you think they will all right just so you know He ain't moving. He's just doing a little, he dead, or he looks dead. Let's find out if he really is. And dude, my boat smells terrible. Me and Ellie Hayes went shrimping two days ago. And I've still got dead shrimp somewhere in this boat and it smells awful. And this boat is a disaster. So, um, but let's see if it works. Like I said, he ain't moving. So we're gonna see if we can bring them back to life. Oh my gosh, see, I told y'all it was nasty down here. We got shrimp all over the place. We got cats coming cleaning up the trash. Man, smells awful. Hopefully nobody's coming back down here for a couple of weeks. Let it kind of air out. The raccoons and cats and possums and everything will come get it out. But we're going to, uh... there you go. There's a shameless State Farm plug. But we're about to see if we can get this thing to come back to life. All right, we got him set up here. He's in our shrimping basket. We use that to dump our shrimp in when we're out on the water. But we're going to see. My guess is if he comes back to life, it's probably going to take about 30 minutes. If he does. If he doesn't come back to life in 30 minutes, it probably ain't happening. So we'll see. be honest with you this thing came back to life a whole lot faster than i thought it would he probably was only sitting out of the cooler maybe five minutes before i started filming and then once i put him in the bucket it was probably maybe another 10 minutes so it happened pretty quick um i will say one of the crabs we had in the cooler did die um i tried another crab kind of off camera and it did come back so two of the three came back and i think the one that didn't was actually submerged underwater so um and i i did hear that you can't you're not supposed to submerge live crabs underwater they will die so that was the reason why that one didn't but two of the three uh came back been about 30 minutes and this joker is definitely coming back to life look at him he's getting a little feisty so i guess the answer is yes you can bring them back i guess technically they're not dead but they kind of go into hibernation phase but pretty cool little trick he's starting to wake up a little bit the longer he's out more feisty he gets. So unfortunately for this guy, spot tail, AKA redfish, are about to start biting. But, so he's probably gonna become bait. But we certainly appreciate his time and effort in this experiment. And uh, thanks for watching. We'll catch you on the next one.